Hey guys, so um, if you watched yesterday's video, you will um, you remember that I mentioned about playing Minecraft story mode to um, just see if I feel like making videos. I, I really want to play this game. It just so happened that it came out today, so I wanted to play it today with you guys, hang out for a little bit and just uh, distract. I guess, from, from recent events, because that's why we love video games, right? It transports us to new worlds, new dimensions, and kind of distracts us from, from sometimes the, the sucky things that happen in real life. So, um, you know what? Let's put that aside, let's focus on this game, and let's play the next episode of Minecraft Story Mode, Season 2. So, if we go into Episodes, last time we played uh, this one, which was Giant Consequences, which was insane. I'm sure that um, I'm sure it will give us a reminder of what actually happened last time. And then um, we're going to go into episode three today, which I'm really excited about. Jailhouse block. It sounds and is it looks from last time pretty insane. Jesse and the gang must brave a dangerous prison and it's even more dangerous inmates to reach the secret of the prison's heart. When the enemy tries to recruit Jesse's friends, will they be able to resist the call? Who knows? Let's start episode three. I'm ready for this. It'll probably recap a little bit and let's play through this episode together and just hang out for a little bit. Let's do this. Here we go. I'm excited to see what is going to happen. So I'm going to shut up for a little bit and give you, well, they're going to give you the recap. Here we go. On Minecraft Story Mode. The world can be a very scary place. It can. Villains can be larger than life. Definitely. And almost impossible to defeat. But we did it. We did do it. The stress of saving the world can turn even the best of friends against each other. And not everyone will be on your side. Yeah. Some will try to take advantage of your kindness, but a true hero will know exactly what to do and will inspire others to do the same. But the scariest thing of all, even for the bravest hero, is discovering the villain is much closer than you think. Crazy. Oh, I forgot about that. Wait, hold on. <laughs> I completely forgot about that. Um, wow. Yep, we know about this. A series adapts to the choices you make. Uh, I completely forgot that they changed the gauntlet hand to not just a different hand, but someone else's hand. So Petra has the gauntlet. It's now red instead of like a um, a turquoise color. And we're being transported to another dimension. I mean, here we go. Let's let's see what happens. We've changed clothes as well. Is that, is that our old school clothes? Like episode one? This? Where on earth are we? Oh, uh, where's my stuff? Yeah, that, that's actually really weird. Gauntlet. Yeah. Oh, Petra's okay wearing it. They change color. Back. Find the admin. Find my friends. The guest will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check-in zone. So, so, so. Oh, they're not our the old. Kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check-in. It's not our old outfit. Hey, disembodied voice. Where am I? It's a prison outfit. Yeah, I heard you. Yeah, it's an obsidian prison. Here we go. Oh, ho, ho. follow the orange line to the check-in zone. We get it. Oh, looking pretty bright up there. Let me slow this down. There we go. Right. Okay. So I think we're gonna go into prison now. I don't. Do I really want to look at this again? Yes. We'll kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check-in zone. No, or else not really. Oh. Got it. Point made. Okay, yeah, we don't want that. <laughs> Come on then, let's go. Look at orange line. Do we really need to do that? Oh, look. An orange line. <laughs> <laughs> let's just follow that. We've got the bedrock as well. Oh, bedrock. I didn't even see that on the floor. I saw the obsidian, though. Pretty intense for a prison. Bedrock? The admin said. A place where I'd never see the light of day again. Yep. We're in trouble. What is this place? 
It's jail. We already know it's jail. Uh, let's look at this. Got the lava as well. Let's look at the obsidian wall first and see what's going down. So, Jesse, how was your day? Oh, it was great. Met a red, glowy, all-powerful, crazy person who trapped me in a near indestructible cage. <sighs> Why are you talking to yourself? You're absolutely crazy, Jesse. <laughs> I'm sure this is leading me to a place full of sunshine and cheer. Let's hope so. I mean, orange is a nice color, so you never know. Let's get a let's get a whittle on. Oh. Sunshine Institute. <laughs> so oh! Okay, uh what is that? Yo! Yo, okay. Hello! mind big hank he's just here to make sure all guests behave he's themselves. cool i like him let's see let's see let's see oh yes jesse well, let me jump the sunshine institute it's a reformatory for people the admin has found difficult oh uh, no i'll be your warden you only have one eye, sir. What happens? So the admin created this nut hut too, huh? Of course. The admin is an endless source of building brilliance. Including this beautiful behavioral adjustment retreat center. So it's a prison. Hey, no, no, we don't use the P word here. <laughs> but it is a prison. Let's not challenge authority. The admin doesn't let us use that word, so we don't use that word understand okay understand you know he's not here right now right you never know okay i like that guy but he's a bit rude come on he's what's in the middle who is that that guy looks insane what about my friends i need to get back the admin put his gauntlet on one of them who knows what he's making them do he gave them the gauntlet <sighs> Man, lucky them. That means they're the admin's favorite. <laughs> How great would that be? Hmm. I bet your friend is living it up. Uh. Enjoying the high life right by the admin's side. Great. I think so. It's more like stressful, dangerous. No two ways around it. It straight up stinks. That's exactly the kind of attitude that got you sent here. And if your friends are anything like you. They'll be making their journey to Betterment right next to you, I'm sure. I uh, know. Now hang on a tick. I have a another guest on my manifest. Who is it? Male, grizzled beard, hair is described as majestic. <laughs> Whoa! Long, long list of aliases. Hey, distract here. him. There he is. Yeah, that's Jack. <laughs> What are you doing? Are you nuts? Okay, what is going on here? Oh, Jesse, thank goodness I found you. This I place know, is... let's get out of here. It can't be this easy, surely. We're gonna escape the prison when you just got here. Stop them, associates! <laughs> Guy's eye is freaking me out, not gonna lie. I can't believe what a mess we're in. And all because I didn't realize Foss was actually the admin. Yeah, that's pretty crazy, actually. What a mess. Manipulated. Shammed. Hey, the admin fooled everyone, not just you. But I should have known. I should have been better. Don't worry. Now the admin has Petra, too. I... I don't know how we're going to get out of this one. Hey, sound the alarm! Nope. We don't stand a chance without weapons. Nope, don't do that. We run! Where? Wherever they aren't. Okay. <laughs> Let's go. I've got braces on, so it makes it makes me run faster. That's how it works, right? The burrows. That sounds interesting. Oh, okay. Here we go. Slide straight underneath. <laughs> they hugged each other. That's funny. Where we go next? Stop hugging each other. Actually, keep hugging each other. That'd be better. If only iron golems actually looked like that, that would be pretty cool. I would enjoy that a lot. Come on, guys. Come on. Look at that. It's so glowy. Glowy. We're going to have to... We can't climb up obsidian. We can go left, though. It's the only option we have. Come on. 
Come on, Jack. I thought Jack was going to be the evil one, but it was actually his friend. I was really wrong. Surely they're going to detect us. They're robots. Is he going to do it? He's gone. Okay, maybe not. Maybe not. There we go. So we got Bedrock and Obsidian left. Sweet. Where do we go, though? We've got to figure out where we are. If we're near Bedrock, what we're really low down. Oh, geez, spiders as well. Great. We don't have any weapons. Wow. We have to, I don't even know, parkour around them. Okay, yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. He's better at parkour than I am. <laughs> A lot better. What's next? Great. More weird monsters. Oh, look at them. They're awesome. Those zombies? Zombie prisoners. They're so cool. I like them a lot. Let's jump over those as well, because they obviously can't jump. Oh! Oh! Ho, ho. The wall ride. That's impressive. This thing is endless. Well, here's a prison, Jesse. Jack. Jack! And you've lost your friend. Jesse, where are you? Where is he? Oh, great. Fantastic. How did you get caught by zombies? Gotcha. <laughs> oh, really wish I had that gauntlet right about now. Yeah, that'd be pretty good. This is pretty intense. I didn't think we'd be escaping the prison already. Yeah, maybe not this way. We only just got here. Well, what are those things? Reaper? What? It's the stuff nightmares are made of. That is unsettling. That's really unsettling. Oh, I keep going bright and dark. There's the only one. It's never just one. Oh no, oh no, oh no! Let's go. I'm out of here. Creepers and... Oh, creepers and spiders. What did we see last time? Creepers and Endermen together? That was pretty cool. I like that too. So they're like creating mobs somehow. Which is quite interesting. Oh, jeez. Okay, this guy's... Get out, get out, get out, get out! Quick! <laughs> so are we in the nether? Probably not, right? They just hired ghasts from the nether. Is there even a way out? I mean... Okay, red slimes as well. Fantastic. This is getting bonkers. Bonkers. I'm not sure I'd use that word, but... Okay, you can jump right over them. That sounds good. Very nice. That's not so nice, though. Okay, okay, what are you going to do? Yo! That was actually pretty cool. Can we climb now? We're good. Are we in the nether? We might actually be. Yeah, this isn't fun. Oh, jeez! Kick him, kick him, kick him. Kick him! Why, did, why, why didn't you kick him? <laughs> Great. And already apprehended in an escape attempt. We're so close. <sighs> that is just... That is just rude. Take this one to the mushroom. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I shouldn't laugh, he's my friend. These guys are intense. Super intense. We almost made it. <laughs> we tried. All right. What's his office look like? Does it look cool? It does. Very much so. Oh, that's the, did you see the map? I have a lot of experience with escaping prisons recently, by the way. You not see my escapist videos, punk? I don't even know this guy's name, do I? Look at that. We're on top of that. Close the door, would you? Yeah, I don't think I know his name yet. Do as you're told. Uh, do I want to be aggressive? I'm gonna be aggressive. Close it yourself. Woo! Fine. Be defiant. Oh, large Henry. <laughs> <laughs> At least we know his name. Defiant. <sighs> Disappointing. Looks like I'll have to keep an extra eye on you and your crew. You've only My got crew. one eye. Oh, let me show you. You only got one eye. You can't 
You can't have an extra eye. You see, oh, no. here at the Sunshine Institute, there are two types of guests. People who make the admin extra angry, such as yourself and your punch-happy friend down there. And there are people who the admin sends to make sure the first group will be uh, well-behaved. I see. Your friend with the glasses is surprisingly feisty for such a skinny guy. If you know what's good for you, Warden, you'll let them go. Oh, I'm sorry, but threats definitely fall under the category of not well-behaved. I guess. Bring up Jesse's leverage, would you? Skinny guy, glasses. Okay, so his name's Funny just story. Warden? When I first got here, I was actually part of the second group. We were just a crazy couple of griefers. Simpler times. Ah. This is radar, right? There he is. Jesse! Oh, I'm so glad you're okay. I was so I was so worried. I'm glad I'm okay. I'm just relieved that you're okay. Oh, you were worried about me? <laughs> Meet the iron breath tape. Oh no. Oh no, this is gonna be grim. Iron bars to hold the victim in place below. Sticky piston above to shove an iron block down over their head. What? That is insane. Oh no. Come on, guys. This is not fun. This is really not fun. Now, I said before that you could follow in my footsteps. That could start now. Oh. Ready to improve that pesky bad behavior of yours and join the good guys? Work for me as an associate and help bring order to these poor, chaotic individuals. Hmm. Don't do it, Jesse! No! What's it gonna be? Oh, jeez. Uh, he's gonna kill Radar. Um. Oh, what do I do? It's gonna I give me time. Quickly. Look, he's I dying. Oh, I'm gonna have to do it. I'm gonna have to do it. Okay, I'll do it. Just stop. Please stop. Oh, that's so great to hear. <laughs> Woo, that was <laughs> that's an intense choice. Hi, hi that was so dark. <sighs> easy, easy there. Radar, was it? You just had quite the harrowing experience. But don't worry, our newest guard, er. Associate oh, jeez. We'll be walking you out. Jesse looks evil Jesse, now. No. I don't know how much more of this I can take. <laughs> Come on, buddy. Come on, like, pull it together now. Don't look at me like that. I did this for you, Radar. I'm trying to protect you. What? No. Well, well, well. Jesse, Jesse. Hold Jesse. on a second. Oh. Stella, what are. How. Well, I appreciate you letting me out of that ice. I can't let that disrupt the new professional relationship we have now, okay? I'm sure you understand. This is weird. <laughs> no, I knew a day of reckoning would come for my rival. Ah, you two know each other? <laughs> nope. Yeah, this place really suits you, Stella. It's cruel, uncomfortable, and nobody likes it. <laughs> oh, you're letting your jealousy get the better of you, Jesse. Pity. Watch out for this one, Warden. Jesse plus anything equals trouble. Now come on, Jesse. No one wants a sour rival. Be like me. I'm a shining example of success. I've barely arrived and I'm already bossing you around. <laughs> Isn't it grand? Let's go, Randall. It's Radar! Uh, that's what I said. Okay. I, uh. Stella's right. Commitment and loyalty to the admin's cause are cornerstones around here. The more friends stick together, the harder they make it for each other. So maybe readjust your concerns. There are bigger silver fish to fry than... than... friends. Jeez, have you always been like this? Always? <laughs> no. What are you hiding, Warden? Not every prisoner here wears orange. 
Jesse. Oh. Let's go, rival. That's right. Go along, Jesse, to the mushroom. The mushroom. Exactly what I was going to suggest. I'll have your job before you know it, Warden. Be careful what you wish for, Stella. Hmm. So he admitted something. He admitted something truthful. It said it at the top, so... He's got a weird past, and I'm sure we're going to find out about it. Right. Look at this guy. He's got an afro going on. There's Nurm. There's Jack. And the mushroom? What are you doing in the mushroom? Hold on a second. New arrivals. Show them around, would you? Thanks. Excuse me? Ha! <laughs> Who are you supposed to be? We don't have a problem, do we? I need a moment to process. Hold on one second, one second. That's Big B. I'm pretty sure that's Big B. She really knows how to make a good impression, doesn't she? She's... Uh, she's kind of the worst. <laughs> oh, you are certainly one to talk, Jesse. Ta-ta, Jesse. I'll be at my post supervising a more impressive cell block. Don't be too jealous. Or do. I wouldn't blame you. I keep forgetting we're actually, like... We're actually a okay, warden right now. I wish I was... I need something to eat. Get my strength back. You're in the right place. Guests make mushroom stew here. Guess I just need some mushrooms then. There's one. Get it. Get it. Oh, I get it. <laughs> so they slowly grow, and then people have to fight over the mushrooms. To um, to make mushroom stew, which is crazy. No more radar. You don't have anything in your inventory. You're usually so well prepared. Usually, only I showed up here with no food, no goods, no nothing, like everybody else. Uh oh. I saw Jack earlier. He might know what to do. It's weird because like we're kind of in prison. But we kind of run the place a little bit. I mean, I don't know, right? Anthony, it is Big V. How you doing, buddy? So fighting over a tiny handful of mushrooms is the only way they can eat? Mm, mm, yep. Mm, mm. Do guards get cookies? <sighs> okay, look. I thought you knew. The guards have a delicate supply of ingredients, none of which are approved by the warden. These cocoa beans. I don't have any wheat for you. But I can tell you who does. Okay. That pal of gruesome can set you up with the wheat. He's my source. Okay, that guy is one tough looking customer. I do not want to deal with him. Look, Jesse, it's simple. You're an associate, he's a guest. You call the shots around here, not him. Okay. So we've managed to get some ingredients for cookies so we can make cookies to give to Radar, who's moaning even though we saved his life. Absolute punk. Right, okay, let's look at... Let's talk to this guy. So, um, we're associates, which are like prison guards, and guests are prisoners. Why can't I do this? There we go. So, I uh, guess the prisoners hey, as are well. are you busting out of here? What? No, of course not. I never do that. Okay. Bit awkward. You got a strength potion though, right? He's got some kind of potion on him. It's very weird. What happens if we just look at him? Haste? Definitely some kind of haste. What is that guy up to? He's trying to break out with some haste potion. That's what he's up to. I'm pretty sure anyway. Okay, let's talk to Rob. Hey buddy. It's Afro Man. Oh, hey there, guard friend. You just caught me putting a happy little finishing touches on my happy little painting. Is it supposed to look like Bob what? Ross? Uh, what you painting? <laughs> I'd so love to paint a happy little mushroom, but none ever stick around long enough for me to paint. I know that you guards don't usually help little old me, but could you build me a happy little mushroom to paint? Uh, Here's some wonderful dirt for you to use. <laughs> if it's not too much trouble after all. Sure. Sure, I can, I can do that. I mean, I don't see why not. We have some mushroom blocks as well. Uh, okay, yeah, let's build a let's build a prison mushroom, shall we? Let's just build all of this. I'm going to put it on a, um, a bed of dirt first. The building is actually pretty good in this game as well. Uh, let's go for clay for the middle. 
So it goes up like this. How high can we go? Can we go even higher? That's as high as we can go? Really? Okay, this is going to be tough. Uh, let's put red here. And then I'm going to just make a little mushroom. And then I need to put a bit like this way as well. Do I need to get rid of this? Yeah, yeah, let's get rid of that. That looks better. And then we'll go around. Okay, this is good. This is good. Oh, I can't put it that way. Oh, no, I've done it too too wide. Jeez. Okay, right, let's do this. There we go. <laughs> this doesn't really look like a mushroom, does it? But, hey, it's the best I'm going to get. Let's spin it around this way. Spin it around this way. Do this, this. This, this, this. I'm going to have to do some in white as well, so I will do that in a second, though. There we go. There we go. I can't really... I can't really look at this properly. It's at a weird angle. All right, so there's my mushroom. I think that looks pretty good. But what I want to do is add some, just some white bits. Just to make it a little bit more mushroomy. So let's take out some of these. There we go. And replace all of those with white clay. There's probably too many. But hey, we're going to make a properly speckled mushroom. And then he can try and paint it. Even though he doesn't have any paints. Which is why he's not really painted very well. Well, let's pop uh, this here. I think that's it. I think we're done. It's like a little sparkly white mushroom. Oh, didn't mean to pause it. There we go. Let's do... Um... Oh, we can't do anything on top. Can we do... I think we used this clay for the middle, didn't we? Let's do this. Yeah, there we go. Tick. Statue is perfect. Now that is just... That is just lovely. Thank you ever, ever so much. No problem, bud. You get painting with your no paints. Please, you must share your thoughts on my work so far. Oh, uh. Don't you hold back now. Honesty's the best policy. Honesty's the best policy. Blank. Kind of hard to judge since it's a, uh, it's it's a blank canvas, dude. <laughs> Everyone's a critic. Yep. Uh, okay, I'm going to walk away from you very quickly. Like, let's go. <laughs> let's go. That looks pretty cool, though. I like that. It makes the mushroom room look even better. Yeah, Actually, mushroom, I guess. Hey, Jesse. Man, I'm glad you're okay. That was a weird hug. When I saw the admin teleporter take, you know, it was, uh, well, it was, uh... You okay? I mean, I, I know I saw you at the entrance, but, uh... Spit it out. Kind of in a tough spot here. What are you trying to say? I'm trying to say that I was worried about you. Okay. It's nice. I was, I, I was scared. After what happened with v not Voss, you know, and and then Petra, and uh... we're gonna stop the admin, Jack. I'm going to get us out of here. Yeah, yeah, I I know you will. Oh, and uh, you might want to get Slim over there something to eat. He's looking a little peaky. I'm trying. Yeah, I'm working on it. Thanks for looking out. Definitely Hang trying. For now, I'll be back. Hey. <laughs> hmm. I like it. Okay, right. Let's see. We need to go and see that weird kind of. I don't even know what to call him. Like Devil Man. I'm not too sure. Oh, that's, he's called Bob Rob as well. I think that's pretty much based on Bob Ross, which is actually kind of funny. There's so much to look at. Um. Let's look at the cell door. I'm just gonna look at most things. Not really much to say about it, though. <laughs> Maybe we shouldn't look at most things. Hmm. I wonder who all those cells belong to. Cellmates, I guess. Right, who's this guy? Just a guest? Brick! I hope you're learning how to be a cooperative champion. Wait, what? what? Is that the admin? You are all here to be reminded of your potential. It's a recording? Come on. Weird. And I hope you'll see it in yourself. As I do. Because if you don't, well, we'll cross that bridge when we come to it, eh? In the meantime, demonstrate your cooperative potential, and you just may become the ultimate champion. The ultimate champion of what? This is weird. Let's talk to Brick. As the associate walked up to Brick, he noticed that the lonely prisoner was narrating all his actions. What? Uh, yeah. Hi, I'm... The associate didn't have to introduce himself. Brick knew all about the associate named Jesse. What? The... Jesse was surprised to learn that the reputation of the Wither Slayer 
Jesus, the leader of the Order of the Stone, had spread so far. That's weird. Rick was curious what Jesse thought of someone who narrated every action around himself. Brick waited for Jesse to say something. Jesse approved of Brick and his quirks. Jesse winked with approval, like this. <laughs> Brick was happy for the approval, but didn't appreciate Jesse stealing his thing. I mean, come on. It was his thing first. This is so weird. Uh, uh, I need food. I need to get some food. Any tips? Brick knows that the prisoners fight over the precious mushroom. But Jesse is an associate. There must be other ways to get food. Yeah. I guess there is. Right, let's just ask him all these questions. So, what are you in here for? Brick remembered the day the admin, annoyed with Brick's constant need to narrate, sent him to the Sunshine Institute to break Brick of the habit. Brick was promised release if he stopped, but nothing will ever break Brick's spirit. He will narrate forever. Okay, great. Uh, have you ever tried to escape? Huh? Ever tried to get out of here? Brick didn't want to tell the associate, but Brick remembered the punching that came from the others. Oh, the punching. So Brick decided to tell all. So weird. Brick knew that the only way out was through the burrows. A seemingly endless labyrinth filled with monsters and who the heck knows what else. Brick also knew that only one person has ever tried to escape. But Brick never speaks her name. Hmm. But Brick will never speak of Prisoner X. So Jesse never asked again. <sighs> That's it for now. Thanks, Brick. That's weird. You're welcome. Uh, Brick told <laughs> Jesse, you're welcome. So, so weird. So I guess when you talk to this guy, that, that was so weird. I don't know what just happened in that conversation at all. You look like a villager. He doesn't want to talk. Okay, right. I need to talk to Oxblood. Hold on a second. Was he has he been in it before? Let's let's uh look at. Can we do that now? Yeah, let's look at him. I'm sure I, I swear I've seen him before somewhere. Maybe not though. You best not be looking at me. Okay. Uh yeah, I definitely haven't seen him before. Okay, let's talk to him. Come on, be nice. Be nice, please. So, uh, I hear you might have some wheat. I need two of them. I don't know who you've been talking to, but it ain't true. Yeah, it is. Wheat is considered contraband in this facility. Cut the slime, guest. Hand over the wheat before I make things difficult for you. Yeah. Oh, wow. Here for all of five minutes. And now you're going to push me around. Yep. Hand it over, punk. <sighs> you better remember this. I want special treatment from now on. You'll get some. Thank you for the wheat, chump. Hey, come here. Wheat and cocoa beans. All yours, Jesse. No way! I've been down here for too long. I can't stand another second! Uh... Okay. Nothing personal. I'm just mega, mega hungry. Whoa, okay, stop ah, this. Give me that. Stop this right now. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm just so hungry. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> Hello? What's going on in here? Jesse? I expect oh, no. far better from my associates than this. Cookie's not that big of a deal. Cookie's not that big of a deal. And just who does this contraband belong to? Hmm? <laughs> you all know that weapons are strictly forbidden at the Sunshine Institute. So who does this belong to? Oh, is it gonna make me choose? Well just come out and tell me. It'll be so uh, much easier for everyone. Uh, Henry won't have to pummel anyone. Not much of a weapon, maybe? No one will need to be pummeled. Sure, if you'd call a wooden sword a weapon. Hey, do you know how hard it was to steal there we go. that wood? I mean, uh, oops. All weapons <laughs> are forbidden. No matter how arguably useless they are. You know that misbehavior means getting sent down a level. And that means... Oh. Oh, not the zombie mind! Not the zombie mind! Oh. Yes. 
Perhaps a little time harvesting rotten flesh will teach you something. Take him away. Well done, associate. You've successfully apprehended your first contraband. Keep up the good work. You know it. At least now I can make a cookie for Radar. Yep. Okay. He's not guarding the table anymore, so we can go and do that. Uh, that was weird. That was really weird. Um, it wasn't our fault, though, so I feel fine about that. That's fine. It, we, we are learning about random other punishments, though, because the zombie mines, the bunker, I think it's called, which is what we ran through before. Um, that's something to do with that. Oh, jeez, how do I make a cookie? Is it this? Is this cookie land? Cookie, come on, in the middle. Is that a cookie? It is. See, I, I remember how to make cookies. If there's anything I need to remember, it's cookie recipes. Well, it's not much, but hopefully it'll help Radar get his strength back. Let's hope so. Right, okay. Let's give him the cookie. Here it is, buddy. Oh, jeez, this is so awkward to use. There we go. Don't let anyone else see it, Here, though. Eat this. Get your strength back. Just eat it. Quick. Quick. Thanks, Jesse. I really appreciate... Uh, yeah, sure, thanks, whatever. Hmm. Why is he acting weird? Interesting attitude there, buddy. I'm gonna have to really step it up. I mean, this is prison. So from now on... Oh. I'm prison radar. <laughs> you got I'm tattoos. Get my own mushrooms. Make my own stew. Disregard my bedtime. Uh... Whatever rules I feel like. Hey, that's the spirit, Radar. You look awesome. Really? Thanks. Get. <laughs> now, get out of here, guard. It's time for prison, Radar, to show this world what he's made of. <laughs> uh oh. That's right. Come at me, dude. Please don't punch me. What's going prisoner on? Prisoner X has escaped. I repeat, Prisoner X has escaped. I forgot about Prisoner X. So they told us about Prisoner uh, X guests, earlier. Please report to the nearest lounge. <laughs> Think that's their cute way of saying cell. <laughs> yep. You should get in one too. You haven't had your Protocol X training yet. I'm good. No. Should not have gone in a cell. It just keeps getting weirder and weirder. Prisoner X. Other inmates were talking about her. Something of an infamous escape artist. Rumor has it she even knows the way through that maze. Most people have never even seen her. They keep her locked up so deep. But everyone's heard of her. And man, do they talk about her. That sounds like the sort of person we should get on our side. Agreed. Someone with that kind of knowledge could be very useful. But where is she exactly? She's apparently locked up on the deepest, darkest level of this place. Cell Block X. <laughs> uh, detecting a theme with the names. Yeah. Yeah, they found their groove and they're sticking with it. We need to get to Cell Block X. That warden seems to have taken a shine to you. Might not be a bad idea to work your way up. Get on his good side. That was my plan. All along, It'd I swear. Useful. Or a disaster. But hey, only one way to find out. Right? Huh. The warden does seem to like me. Working the joy to our benefit. Prison radar approves. His voice is so funny. Now he's changed okay, it. Okay, it's a plan. You stay here and rest up. I'm going to find a way to get us to cell block X. Sounds good. Will you do that? I'm going to study this place. Sweet. Before we're through, I'll know it like the back of my hand. I like this. I like the theme of this episode. This is really cool, actually. But how to get promoted? Hmm. Uh, I don't know. I don't want to do anything to that guy. That guy sure looks suspicious. If I can catch him doing something against the rules, maybe I can get promoted. Oh, oh, I don't know. Um, he's quite scary. Let's have a look. See what he's doing. He has left when he's not supposed to, I guess. So we could get him done for that. But he has cat pictures on his wall. That's pretty bad. Uh, he has mush. He likes mushrooms. I, I can't see the cat picture. It's up there, I promise you. Right, let's uh, look at this. That painting feels out of place. It's like the posters in The Escapists. There it is. He has a cake picture as well. Uh, let's listen to the wall first. He must get his wheat from somewhere, to be honest. 
That was a cow. That was definitely a cow, wasn't it? Rem oh, secret door? Uh, I'm gonna punch this first. Secret buttons, nice. Now we're on to something. Okay. Now the question is, what do they do? Yeah, so there's a code, right? Let's see if we can remove the secret door. I'm gonna guess there's some kind of mushrooms or cow behind here. Yeah. That didn't work. Let's see what I can do with this. Oh geez, what are you doing? So what are the buttons for? I think there's another room back there. Okay, time to see what tall red and Gruesome is hiding. Okay. Uh, right. Let's press. Let's press this one and see what happens. Okay. Looks like the buttons move the blocks. So, do I just press them all in an order? That button moves that block. Okay. I'm slightly confused. And then this one does. This moves those blocks. Got it. Okay. So. Wait. What? <laughs> I think it might be two, three, one. Two, and then I, yeah, I think it's two, three, one, and then one should remove the middle one, or does it close the top one? I don't actually know. Let's see what happens. No. Wait, did I have it already? I didn't, did I? Two, three, one didn't work. Is there a clue around here? Cats. No. There's definitely no clues. Just having a guess. Right, let's do three, one, two, maybe. The right button seems to open the first and the third rows of blocks. Okay. I need one that opens Find the right combination of buttons to put all the blocks in the open position. Looks like the button closes, closes the top closes the and bottom row. But and open. Open. You're saying too much, Jesse. You're saying too much, buddy. Uh, so I did three, one, two, then. I'm never good at these puzzles. Like I'm really bad at these. The left button first, and then the right button. The door will open. Okay, he's literally just told me. Um, he's just told me the. the, the, the <laughs> he's just told me the solution. <laughs> I got that bad that he had to tell me the solution. Go on, push the button, buddy. There we go. Reset it. This isn't actually part of the puzzle. I think the right and left buttons might be the key. Okay, let's do left and right. Here we go. So one, three. That's it. The puzzle was not very nice to me. But hey, it's it's quite a good um quite a good what's it called? Quite a good combination and secret door. Yes. If um if I can't even get through. Now if only someone had been around to see me being this impressive. Hmm. I was here. I was here. Oh, he does have a mushroom. A mushroom? What are you doing here? <laughs> Sounded me like I could ask you the same question. Yeah. Mind explaining what you're doing in my most private of spaces? I'm going. Visitors ain't welcome. I'm going to tell on you. You are most definitely a visitor. Easy there, big guy. No need to get steamed. My room. My room. Short stack. Uh oh. If you hadn't noticed, you left the hole open. Now get out of my cell before you regret getting in it. Did I hear mooing? Uh oh. oh come on. Here we go. You're in trouble Excellent now. Work, new associate. Promotion is mine. You see, this is how you get promoted. Work your way up. But first, to maintain order. This creature cannot be allowed to undo the balance of the mushroom. Oh no. Hear it, uh, would you, Jesse? But then it'll be... An ordinary cow. Yes, you know, bringing back the balance of the mushroom. I thought that was obvious. Uh, is that really a bad thing what? to do? No. Don't do it, Jesse. Not liking your hesitation here, Jesse. Why is it such you a bad thing? You won't. I'm doing it. You do want to be promoted. I'm, I, I have to. I have to. I'm sorry. I'm, you. I'm sorry. Fine, I'll do it. That guy's gonna hate me, bro, and he's massive. <laughs> Trim it. See, he's okay. It doesn't hurt them. Just chain back to a normal cow. See, he likes the shears. Go on, do it, buddy. Go on, snip him. Snip him. Just do it. Jesse, really? I can't walk. It's just a moose room. It's fine. There we go. See? 
absolutely fine. Uh oh. What did I do? <laughs> I hate it when it says that because sometimes you're like really lost. It's just a cow! It's absolutely fine, buddy. See, you're still friends. Jeff. Jeff. You still recognize me right, buddy? Jeff. Jeff. <laughs> it's still Jeff, though. That wasn't so hard. Jeff didn't no, die. Jeff's just a brown you, cow now. Jesse, it's clear you are ready to advance to bigger and better things. You've been promoted to the lower levels. The zombie mine. Okay. I get to be your boss now, Jesse. Aren't you the luckiest associate of all? Nope. Now get a move on. We don't have all day. I very much dislike us. He's such, such a punk. Such a punk. He's happy though. I had to do it, guys. I so had to do it. I'm sorry. The cow is fine. We didn't kill the cow. It's absolutely fine. He's still Joff. He's just a little, Welcome to the zombie mines, a, a little Jesse. less smart. Hey, the llama's here too. Gosh. Every few minutes, a million gross zombies spawn. The equally gross prisoners dispatch them and collect the zombie flesh, which is it's gross. I get it, but why? It's all part of the admin's plan. I, uh, you know, I think. To toughen people up. Okay. So it makes the admin happy. I can't believe you're actually behind the admin in all this. That you actually believe in him. You're just jealous that I'm in good with him and you got tossed into prison. Who knows? Maybe if you work hard enough, someday he'll give you a job, I don't know, cleaning up Luna's climate controlled llama house. <sighs> Though I suppose now that we're colleagues at all, I shouldn't leave you completely in the dark. Our job is to supervise the guests as they deal with the yeah. endless zombie hordes. Even you couldn't mess this up. Eh, maybe I should knock on wood. Wow, I can't believe this is the Sunshine Institute's idea of a promotion. Yeah. This is awful. I know, right? You, you are awful. You just can't. You... Okay, yes, it's absolutely atrocious. <laughs> This may not be my dream destination, but at least I'm better off than her. Her who? Oh. Prisoner X, you must have heard that alarm before. She was recaptured, but not before taking out a lot of guards. Oh. Don't get any ideas, though. Only the warden's allowed to see her. No, if you'll excuse me. Luna and I are off to prove why we're the best associates. I just noticed that Luna has a associate outfit, which is quite funny. <laughs> it's really funny, actually. This is cool, though. I like the look of the prison as well. Everything looks awesome. I love the way it's set up. I love the whole the idea behind it. We need to find out who this... Uh, why is she green? Why is that woman green? That's weird. But we need to find out... We know where chemical... No. Uh, we know where Prisoner X is. We just need to find out who who she is and how we get in there. Uh, sunshine posters. What do I need to do here? I just need to supervise because there's zombie spawners here, so they're gonna spawn in any moment now. I guess while I'm doing something else. This place has sun and shine in it. This place doesn't have either. Zombie and despair might be more accurate words. Yeah, that's true. I think I just need to wait for a zombie to spawn, and then I can help or supervise. Probably shouldn't help them. Stella, what's going Why on? Are you being such a brat, Luna? Come on! So mean. Oh! Ow, Luna, stop that! <laughs> I'm hitting my llama limit, Luna. She's just not your biggest fan, Stella. I don't get it. I am very deserving of fandom. No. Don't you have some guests to punch or something? You just got told by your own llama. You spat in your mouth. That's gross. And also pretty awesome because you're annoying, Stella. Right. <laughs> Let's see what else. Can we just look at the door? Uh, oh, wait a second. Wait a second. Hole in the wall. Let's shift straight over to here. You know what? Uh, holding shift doesn't really speed him up that fast, does it? Jesse's not a fast walker. Hey, what is this? The big guy, Oxblood, was down for a while and headbutted the wall. Not sure why. 
But man, he has a hard head. We just haven't fixed it yet. Yeah. <laughs> it's redstone, though. There's redstone behind the wall. Which must... Hmm, I wonder what it connects to. Must open the door, right? Let's have a look. It must do. Or something other... Something else crazy. In, but this door won't budge. Hey, don't even bother trying to get in. See those item frames? Only the admin and the warden have the right items. They could be anything. Besides, why would you want into Prisoner X's cell? That's just bonkers. Stay away. Yeah, what dummy would want that, huh? Prisoner X hates associates most of all. She'd eat you alive if you got in there. I reckon it's someone we know. Hmm, I'm just gonna so put it out there. Redstone leads to this door. If I can bypass the redstone circuit, I can open the door. Okay. But how? What happened? What are you guys doing down here? We couldn't leave you by your lonesome, so we cooked up some trouble and got ourselves sent down too. We're in this together. You guys rock. I'm so glad to see you. Almost as glad as we are to see you. I like how Radar has tattoos. Find, That's hilarious. Find something to bypass a redstone circuit and get this door open. This will lead us to Prisoner X. She can help us get out of here for good. Jesse, no fraternizing with the guests. Shush. Well, there is someone in here who came from the outside who may still have a hefty inventory. Ah, oh, Stella. Great. But would she have the stuff? How are we going to get her inventory, though? Do we have to beat her up? Surely not. That sounds a bit aggressive. Hey, Radar, are you okay? That mushroom, it was intense, huh? No kidding. Standing up to the warden, though? That's my Jesse through and through. Thanks, buddy. Fist pump. But those poor prisoners. No food? Rough stuff. And Stella? Here? We can't catch a break. But first things first. Let's find this Prisoner X and get out of here. Cool. So if Prisoner X is that powerful, so powerful that she just destroys multiple wardens all the time, or um, associates, whatever they want to call them, uh, she's going to be pretty insane. Which is... Uh, I'm trying Jesse, to think who we've met before. You can't keep socializing with your guest friends over there. It's bad form. Gross. Crafting table. Yeah, uh, about that. I, uh... Need your help. I need to make a lever. Pronto. Why exactly? Not that I, you know, really care. Uh. You'd never know when you need a lever. That's what I always say. A lever? In a prison reformatory? <laughs> huh. Really, Jesse? Not helping you here. No, not risking angering the admin. I had to really prove myself to get this gig as it is. But he's why you're down here. Come on. And he is who will help lift me back out again once I finish helping him run this horrible, smelly mud pit. Maybe you make some good points, but not enough of them. I have a place here. Respect. Uh, you know, a power and the, yeah, the works. It's actually very prestigious. Many, many people would love to have this position. Just help me with the lever. There's no way to escape. What could it hurt? Give me. Oh, curse your flawless logic. Fine. She's so dumb. But don't ever ask me for anything else ever again. Oh. That's it for us. No more rivals. No more anything. Okay, that's fine. You can get out of here. Although, no matter how many worlds I see, it always seems to come back to levers. Why would my story change then? So we now can't get anything else from her. So maybe later on in, maybe not this episode, but later on in the future, we might need something from her, but maybe we can't get it. I'm not sure, but I don't know how we get this lever without it. Let's build this lever. Here we go. Stick and nope, <laughs> stone and stick. Lever. Create. I love the crafting table mechanics hey, in this game. This. It's so cool. Oh no. Zombie wave incoming. Prepare yourself. I forgot about that. Here we go. <laughs> punch them. Actually, we don't need to punch the zombies at all. We just got a lever. This works. I'm confused. Wait, what? What do we need to do? We need to. Do we need to hit the lever? Oh jeez. Okay, we don't need to hit the lever. We need to hit the zombies with the torch. There we go. Come on. Come on, zombies. Why am I helping them? Because I'm not a prisoner. I'm not a guest. I don't need to do this. No, get away from me, punk. 
Get away from me. <laughs> if only this worked in real Minecraft where you could just smack them with torches. That'd be so much better. Like, tons better. Come on, buddy. Burn alive. There we go. So much easier. I'm just going to keep on hitting you. There we go. <laughs> that didn't work at all. Come on. Just get get back where you belong. Come on, buddy. Come on. Get out of here. There we go. I want, I got lever to press. Let's burn him in the butt and get rid of him. Oh, jeez. Really? Okay. Okay. Fine. I'll fight you. Okay. Maybe I won't. Let's just bypass it. Here we go. Pull the lever, buddy. Open this bad boy. I want to find out who this is. There's magma on the floor, though. Be careful. Guys, come on. Who's it going to be? I really think it's going to be someone we know. Prisoner X will escape. Shush. Shush right now. Oh. Is that Prisoner X? Everyone is scared. Apart from the zombies. Whoa. Who is this? Close to me, okay? Guys. Oh. Petra. Uh. Of course. Of course it's Jesse. Why am I not surprised? I'm i I'm so confused. Admin? The warden told me you were zooming up the associate ladder. Now you're trying to disrupt the therapeutic benefits of my zombie mind. Yeah, a little bit. What gives? I don't know if you're dense or what, but working somewhere usually means you don't do things to actively destroy where you work. Yeah. H hang on, admin. It it's just a misunderstanding. L let's just talk this out. Misunderstandings? Oh, we are way past misunderstandings. Way past. Uh-oh. <laughs> so who's Prisoner X? I'm confused. <laughs> Edmund, sir, I'm very disappointed in you, Warden. I I'm, j I'm, j uh, yeah, I'm just a nervous eater. I'm sorry. No, no, not that. Your star guard, Jesse, is nothing but a saboteur. Yep. You were my greatest hope. You were moving up the ranks, and now you have ruined me. I thought you were. Following in my footsteps. Sorry, buddy. Yeah, sorry about that, Warden, but you kind of work for a terrible person. He doesn't deserve an apology, Jesse. Oh, for the love of... Enough! I'm ruling you. No, 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 no. Oh, jeez. I want to know his story. His story's a little bit... Okay, maybe not. See you later, buddy. Oh, no, he's a prisoner. You, and you, and you, and especially you. Eh... Uh, I've been looking for an opportunity for you to prove your loyalty. Oh, gee. To prove your worth as my champion. What are you going to do? Are we going to have to fight each other? The admin's kind of cool. Like, I like the bad guys sometimes. Even though they're bad guys, I like the design and just concept so, of bad guys. Unless you want to be He's pretty cool. Naughty list, I suggest you pull out your sword and attack. Jesse. Oh man, here we go. And as for you, Jesse, well, you don't think I don't believe in fair play. <laughs> now we'll have some real fun. So confused. Who is Prisoner X? Is Prisoner X? Oh, I'm so confused. Right, let's just play it out and see what happens. I had such high oh jeez, really? The highest of hopes. Oh man. I think I'm gonna have to push her off. Whoa, okay. What's going on? This is awkward. What did you do? The gauntlet's so weird now. Petra, what are you doing? I'm so sorry, Jesse. I don't think you are. Are you afraid, Jesse? Slice. Oh, Jeez. Oh my goodness. No. Oh my goodness. She's insane. What are you doing? No, stop. I'm going to slice you, bro. She's insane. I'm going to have to do it. I can't. This isn't happening. You kind of have to, bro. Zip it, Jesse. We only got one shot at this. Okay. I'm going to go to the admin, and then we'll both attack him. Just trust me. I didn't think she was being weird. 
But surely you're not going to be able to just destroy him like that. Surely. Okay, here we go. Here we go. She's doing it. She's doing it. Here we go. Oh, Kill him. Now let's get him. Oh, jeez. I knew it. Like, it's not going to happen. <laughs> you're, you're joking, right? That's your big idea. Swords can't hurt me. Uh-oh. Yeah, this is bad. Oh, all I asked you to do is fight your friend to the death, and you can't even do that. Oh, man, he's ripping everything apart. I don't want you to be my friend anymore. And I don't want you to be my friend either. Uh-oh. In fact, as far as I'm concerned, this whole place can burn to the ground. What about Prisoner X? What about all of us? Okay. The Institute remains inescapable. So what do I care? I'm leaving. And I'm never thinking about any of you ever again. So I'll just be my own friend now. Okay, bye. Can't dwell on the setbacks. Gotta keep looking forward. Do you even listen to yourself when you talk? Yeah. That made zero sense. To you, maybe. But I don't care what you think. <sighs> I'm gonna have loads of friends soon. After all, everyone loves Jesse, right? No. What? <gasps> no way. This man's a shapeshifter. You coming? I thought you would. Oh, no. So Good news, Jesse. You're not my rival anymore. Since you're going to rot down here forever, you're nothing now. Coming, darling admin. Stella is just the beginning. Your other friends will fall in line too. Lucas, Axel, Olivia, all of them. Man. Don't worry. I'll take good care of Beacon Town. That's so bad. He's going to... Oh, he's going to pretend to be me. He's gone. He's got the Jesse, gauntlet now as well. Stop him. Oh, Petra. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so, 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 so sorry. What? No. You have nothing to apologize for. Who is Prisoner X? So Prisoner X is really our ticket out of here. I don't know. I don't know. I still feel like we're going to know her. I'm not sure. I'm calling it, but I might be wrong. Let's see. Let's see what happens. Oh, I'm so glad you're all right, Petra. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, that was... That was pretty bad. After he took me away, I, I was in this weird place. Time and everything was so strange. I felt like I'd been there forever, and I started to worry you'd given up on me. We didn't know where you were. Um, Petra, are you crazy? We would never give up on you. Yeah, what Jesse said. Hey. Well, that's a nice thing for you to say. I saw Beacon Town, Jesse. They were all worried about you. No one knew where you were or if you were alive. I'm sure the admin's heading there right now. Wearing Jesse's mug to boot. It's freaking messed up, yo. It's true. Identity theft is no joke. No. Admin will wish he had never even seen my face when I'm done with him. No one wears my face except for me. <laughs> it's such a weird thing to say. We made it. Oh, we got that. We got the llama as well. She left the llama behind. Okay, that's good. Here we go. So this is her cell. Jeez. It's really. Oh. Look out! No, Oh, jeez. Oh, so not good. It's red as well. Yeah. Talk about some intense security. What do we do now? Just stick close to Jesse, all right? Mm. We'll be fine. Don't worry. Yeah, you guys go on. Get Prisoner X. We got this numb. Don't worry, buddy. Don't worry. If I wanted to imprison the dreaded Prisoner X, that's where I'd do it. I think that's where we need to go. Oh. Almost missed that. 
Just be careful, Nerm. You have no hands. <laughs> okay, now all we have to do is cross this conduit, reach the platform, jump down, and not die. Fair. Come on, I think we can make that jump. We can try. Here we go. You're up next, nerd. Come on, nerd. Don't die, please. I'll be so mad. Do I need to catch him? Yeah, I do. Woo! I predicted it. Okay, now you, Loon. Yeah, Loon is the best. Look at her smile. Seriously, how do you do that? She's a llama, bro. She's got this. <laughs> there it is. Last jump. It's got TNT on it, though, so I don't know if that's a, a great idea. Who could it be? Who could it be? Another llama, maybe? We need to be careful, dudes. Who is it? 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 Hmm. I forgot about this. There was a preview of this in the, the next, what's it called? In the other one, wasn't there? There was a preview of someone in a, I completely forgot that this was here, but um, on the end of last episode, it showed us this person. Of course it did. Oh my goodness, okay, okay, stop, stop. Who are you? I'm Jesse. I'm Jesse, you must be Prisoner X. Bold of you to come here, not knowing who you're dealing with. I could shove you right into that lava, and you deserve it for being so trusting, so gullible. Just one little push. I'm not your enemy, you don't need to threaten me. Yes, but it's so much fun to threaten you. I don't get much fun these days. Look, Prisoner X. Zara. Zara. You're supposed to know how to get out of here. So we don't know who she is. But where did you get that idea? Oh. No one's ever escaped the Sunshine Institute. That's why they tossed you in here, right? This place is intense. I don't think they put you down here for crafting illegal flower pots. Yes, it is rather excessive, isn't it? The admin stole my identity and he's running around with my face doing horrible things in my name. I gotta get out of here now. Romeo was here? Just now? Well, um, the admin was, but who's... Romeo. That's his real name. Oh, okay. You didn't think admin was his given name, did you? How do you know his real name? Oh, we're very old friends. I know his real name, and much, much more. Oh. You must really be something if you made him so mad. He almost never comes down here in person, except to put the warden's feet to the fire from time to time. Well, there is no more warden. The admin fired him. That's fantastic. We won't have any trouble escaping with that little creep out of the picture. So now you want to help any me? Any enemy of Romeo is a friend of mine, I always say. Okay. Romeo the admin. I'm tech said that how can I trust you know the way out oh don't worry I know the way I'm the only one who does you know the way then show me let's get out of here just one problem this whole room is rigged to explode if I step one foot out of it explode take a look around told you if someone doesn't stand on at least one of these pressure plates on the floor these sticky pistons will retract. Lava meets TNT. And then the whole place blows up before you can say kaboom. <laughs> That's a stone pressure plate. That means I can't just use a block. Yeah. Oh, it's fine. One of your silly companions can stay behind. The rest of us can go. That's the situation. Oh, look, she got off. That's the only way out. Ah. Uh. All getting out of here. No one's staying behind. Oh, I'm afraid that's quite impossible, Jesse. One of them is going to have to stay. Are you kidding me? Need to be a wet slime about all this, but we have to get moving. I can't just leave them here. Then just leave one of them here. As long as one pressure plate is stood upon, the trap won't spring. So either the villager or the llama must remain behind. Are you kidding me? Nerm, no, you can't do that. Oh, come on. We seriously don't have time for this. 
I'm leaving. If you're interested in escaping the Sunshine Institute alive, I suggest you do the same. No. Don't make me choose. Uh, duh. Why? Bring Num or bring Luna. Uh, I really don't know what to choose. Uh, there's really no good choices. Um, man, so here's my thinking. So Num is... I think I'm going to bring Num with me. Because I feel like Luna can actually just, you know, come through and hold down the fort until we get back. Uh, she looks like she's kind of just chilling anyway. She's kind of giving off some hints. But Nerm looks pretty upset. Nerm is willing to stay. I think Luna is going to be the best one to stay. Just because the admin can come back and get her. Um, we can come back and get her. She's laying down. I'm going to bring Nerm. I'm sorry if you disagree with me, but there's there's really no good choice here. I'm going to bring Nerm. I'm sorry. So that's a, that's a really, really you gross to choice. And you need to come with me. Jack wouldn't know what to do without you. That too. <laughs> Luna, stay right there, okay? What a good llama. See, I told you she's up for it. You're a hero. You're a good llama. You're a hero, Luna. She knows. She knows. We'll be back. Don't worry. We got you. How did you... My straight jacket? Oh, that was the easy part. If you're done with your tearful goodbyes, we have a prison to escape from. She's actually, like, really impressive. She's crazy, in fact. Ah, <laughs> oh, you got this, Luna. We'll be back, don't worry. You got this. Aw, oh, that, that's sad. Worst choice so far, though. Easily the worst choice so far. Oh, uh, Prisoner X, I presume? Yeah, guys, this is Zara. Zara, the guys. Hello. Yeah. <laughs> What's the matter, friend? <laughs> Nerm here says you wouldn't let him stay and left Luna in his place instead. <laughs> Nerm, you can't blame yourself, pal. We'll come back for her, Nerm. Somehow. We will. Also, Nerm has arms. He says he'll take your word for it. He, he didn't have his arms closed just a minute ago. For what it's worth. I'm glad you made him come with you. Thank you, Jesse. Can we get going, or is the reunion still underway? Yeah, we're going. We're going. Come on. We got this. Look at us. New team member. Run for your lives! The guests have escaped their lounges! Uh-oh. The warden's been fired! <laughs> <laughs> Zombie meat is back on the menu! Yo, they're when crazy. I that warden, I'm gonna make him pay for what he put me through. Yipes. Wouldn't want to be the warden right now. Every prisoner in this place wants to tear him to pieces. He better watch his back. And his front. And his side. Yeah, lots of watching in his future. I'm worried about the guy. Whatever happens won't be pretty. Well, beauty is subjective, but... Yeah. Not gonna be nice. Yeah. <laughs> I kind of wanted to learn more about him. I wonder if we, we still will. Not too sure. Hey, hold up. Let's see if they left us any weapons. Weapons, sweet, sweet weapons. <laughs> I saw a pretty gnarly shield. There it is. Look at that. An enchanted diamond I could sword. Take the enchanted oh. iron sword, or the diamond sword with no enchantment. The diamond sword will last longer, but the iron sword is enchanted with sharpness. Not bad, hmm. I don't actually know my maths with this. I don't know which one's more powerful. I'm pretty sure a diamond sword is seven power, like seven damage, and then an enchanted sword, like an enchanted diamond sword is nine, I think. I don't know, I think they're the same. Just one's shiny. I'm gonna take diamond just because I'm positive. I know that's pretty cool and it will last longer. 
Just in case. You never know. I think that might be the same okay, though. Definitely feeling better with a sword in my hand again. Oh, look at that. Poison right. arrows. Hey. <laughs> what? It's versatile. Yeah. Not bad. It looks cool too. No, I'm with the double axes. Actually, not a bad look. Looking good, gang. Now let's You go. jerks better not have taken all the cool weapons before I got to dig through. Uh oh. Friends reunited. It's a prison miracle. Even if Jeff is a little but completely ah. different. I ought to pound you to pulp for what you've done to Jeffy Boo. Incoming Oh, 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 oh. Do not do this, buddy. Look big, red, and ugly. Maybe you should reconsider your emotions right now. I don't want no trouble. I'm out of here. See, Jump is the that same. He's just red. Well, now that that's over with, can we get moving now, please? Oh, the goss as well. The opening should be just around this corner. Situation here. Uh oh. Back! Back! All of you! One more step and it's to Bonesville! Jesse! Hey! You're wearing a guard's outfit! Well, guards ain't in charge no more! Who are you? And furthermore, I'm not a fan of guards. So, thusly, you're getting beat up a bunch. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, it's the happy little jerk who oh, no. my happy little painting. I bet you're not so happy now, are you? <laughs> Jesse, you freed Prisoner X? Just when I thought you couldn't ruin my life anymore! What in the world were you thinking? Uh... Holy crud! It's Prisoner X! <laughs> They're out of here. <laughs> I think you've clearly lost your mind. She is bad news. Actually, no, she is way worse than I wonder what she did. News. Need her help, Warden. It's the only way to stop the admin. Did you know she was once an admin too? Ooh. The admin had to take her powers away. She tried to destroy him. I promised the admin I'd never let her free, no matter what. And I'll keep that. Oh man. Uh oh. Even if I need to blow us all up to do it. <sighs> oh! Who is that? Who did that? Yo, he just died. Who did that? Lady <laughs> Tate. Bob Ross. Oh no, it was you. She just killed him. Uh Okay. Why are you all staring at me? It's making me uncomfortable. So is it true what he said about you? You were an admin? Well, ugh, it's complicated. We want answers, Zara. Definitely. Uh, fine. Yes, I was an admin. Ages ago, Romeo took my admin powers away from me just before he banished me to this pitiful prison. Hmm. But I'm not the villain here. Romeo and his little warden were the ones who put you down here, not me. So glare in another direction. I'm sick of secrets. You should have said something. I assumed you wouldn't take the news well, and how right I was. No more secrets. Fine. No more secrets. There's no way we can trust her now. Wait, so an admin can be stripped of their powers? Ugh, it's not simple, but yes. Ah, uh, okay. So what do we... We don't have time for this. It won't be long before Romeo finds out what's happened down here. Yeah, I guess we should keep moving. Follow me. Okay, we just got the, these labyrinth thing, the bunkers, the bumpers, whatever they're called, to get past, and then we're good. I'm, I'm sorry, Jesse, but do you really trust her? Not anymore. She's not right in the head. Jack, you haven't seen what the admin can do. We need all the help we can get. But her? Really? Do you have any other ex-admins in your inventory? Yeah, I don't trust her either. I want you keeping an eye on her at all times. Yeah. Who's got it? I like Petra's new outfit. It's pretty cool, actually. Romeo 
did always love creating new nightmares at every opportunity. Oh, it's so gross. I like the zombies though, they're very cool. Seriously, what's with these monsters? They're all glowing. They're pretty scary looking, Jesse. Let's be scarier. Alright, we've got the sword. Okay, cool. They're gonna explode though, the other ones. We don't want that. Yeah. Double. Look at that. Hitting the double. We just need to get rid of the... Well, the, the not these spiders. We <laughs> That's awesome. We need to get rid of the, the creeper spiders because they're the craziest. Never just one. Never. Yo, look at these moves. Nice work. Thanks, Jack. Showing some real cool moves. Impressive. Less talking, more stabbing. <laughs> She's pretty crazy. I like her a lot. But I don't trust her. Right, here we go. Let's go. Ha <laughs> ha! Slice and dice. Whoa! Okay, ouch, that hurt. Get you out of here. Thank you. Last one. Perfect. Whoa! Okay. <laughs> Two with one as well. That's impressive. Thanks. I was worried then. I thought she was going to pop her in the brain. You got this, buddy. See, if we had a llama, I don't know if a llama would be able to help us out here. Go on, Nerm. Slice and dice, buddy. Slice and dice. Oh, these, these fight scenes are so cool. Look at that. There we go, Nerm. Good job, buddy. I think I made the right choice. Jesse! What are we going to do here? Oh, it's a cave spider. Give me a boost. Oh, this is going to be awesome. Yes! Yes! Oh, that was amazing! There's so many of them, though. How are we going to destroy them all? It's going to take some pretty cool moves to be able to do so. Yeah. Fist bump! What next? We just need to get out of here. Oh, jeez. Okay. Get out of here, buddy. We don't need you exploding. Nice! So the creeper spiders can blast through obsidian, which is cool. Are we here? Nope. Let's go. <laughs> it wasn't like this before. We there's got to be. A oh no. Uh, Zara, you are right there. Just go. shut up and let me think. Oh no. See, I told you we shouldn't have trusted her. She's lost. I said, just let me think. Think or make something. Oh jeez. It's fine. Even if there's a setback, we can still get out of this. Not exactly a vote of confidence, but I'll take it. Look, come on, get on with it. There's a zombie. There's two zombies. There's many zombies. Wait, we can just build to the top of the wall and get to the other side that way. Yeah. Next, we've got dirt. Good to me. Go on, let's do this. There's a lot of dirt down here. We can do this. Why did we just do this ages ago? The beginning of the episode. <laughs> This place is creepy. Oh, what's that? Diamonds. I see diamonds. Whoa. What are you... There it is. What is it? Hey, wait. Where are you going? She ditched us. Oh, no. This is not good. Is that like a gray ghast? Yo, look at that. That is insane. Guys, don't come up here. Why? Why? Whoa, that thing is nuts. Oh, okay, got it. Yeah. <laughs> well, how are we supposed to get rid of this thing? Oh, we just bash it back, right? Okay, that works. I was I was worried that wasn't gonna work. Create some pretty awesome things to be fair. Need to bash another one back. Oh man, are you kidding me? Huh? There we go. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. I missed them. <laughs> At least I didn't get hit. Whoa, okay. Okay, I need to get out of there. Are we good? They're calling backups. Not not what I expected. This thing is insane, guys. 
I just need to bat back a few. Just keep on batting them. Keep on batting them. <laughs> There's got to be enough. It's not. Really? How many do I need to hit to be able to kill it? I mean, there's there's so many fireballs. So many. Okay, that looks good. Still not dead though. Oh my goodness. This thing is insane, guys. Look at it. You're gonna make me Oh jeez, run. Just run. Just get out of here. It's nowhere near ahead. Use A and D to speed up and slow down. Okay, let's uh oh my goodness. Really? I still need to still need to fire these back. This is mad. I, I've got loads of lives left though, so I'm good. I still need to fire some of these back. Look at him. He's hitting his own. Oh, look, he's hitting his own gas. They're not happy with that. That's good. Okay, I've only got half health left though, which is bad. We just need to make it so that he starts hitting the other gas and then they get mad at him. Which I think is what's happening right now. I'm pretty sure. I'm not 100% sure, but I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Oh, man. No, no, no. I don't want to keep losing lives. Do I just need to avoid it? I think I'm just going to avoid it. They're kind of doing their job for me. I don't think there's many that I can bash backwards. I've already got two hearts as well, so this is not good. Come on, Jesse. Come on, take him down. Take him down. You got this. No, no, no. <laughs> this thing's insane. Actually insane. You're going to make me jump across ghasts? Really? Okay, let's do it. Here we go. This can only go one way badly, but let's see if we can do it. Oh my goodness. Hey, in his head. Let's see if we can control him. That'd be insane. Did it work? <laughs> this is so bad. Let's keep on, keep on doing it. Three is the magic number, buddy. Make him kill all the gas first, though. That'd be much better. There we go. One more time. The killer blow. It's so like a wither and a ghast mixed together. It's insane. I like it. And we're done. That was insane. I know, right? That's what that I just means said. You're amazing. <laughs> that was unbelievable. And you stuck the landing. Nice. Oh, that? It's just my perfect reflexes and photographic muscle memory. Yeah. Well, there it is, guys. Our ticket out what of here. What is that? That is sparkly. The sparkly <laughs> Is that diamond? Sure is. Where is everyone? That lunatic is going to be inventory if she's not careful. Is she still down there? We should lend her a hand, shouldn't we? Oh, it's going to make us choose. I she think we should like help her. She got us out. not abandoning her. I told her I'd help her escape. It's time to prove it. We can't just leave her. Come on. Oh, I can't believe we're doing this. We can't just leave her because... Oh, jeez. Okay, you need to get that off your back. There we go. <laughs> Gas are one of my favorite mobs. I like them. You came back. I said I'd get you out, didn't I? Now show us the way. Now, hopefully... You didn't have to do that. I appreciate it. Hopefully, she trusts us a bit more. Because I don't trust her, so hopefully she won't do anything nasty towards us. That was the idea, anyway. I'm not a very trusting person. Romeo betrayed me. I have trouble getting along with others. I'm not much of a people person anymore. If I ever really was, it's gone now. You've been away a while. You'll figure out how to get along with people again. Doubtful. After what I've seen. You'll see. There's something else you should know. There was a third admin named Fred. Fred? Where what is name? He? Dead. Oh. He and I fought Romeo for control of the world. We lost. Interesting. Right, here we are, the diamond teleporter. Uh, where's the rest of it? Yeah, how are we supposed to escape? This doesn't even go up that far. That's because we're not going up, we're going down. Down? There is no down. We're standing on bedrock. You can't go any lower. You might think so, but that's where we need to go, below the bedrock. Oh. Everybody knows there's nothing under the bedrock except nothing. And also certain death. I really do want to believe you. Then believe me. Go first. Get her to go first. I'd rather take my chances in the maze than listen to any more of her lies. Any of you are welcome to join me. 
That's crazy talk. All those monsters. I don't care. She's an admin. An admin killed Voss, then stole his identity, and then... Remember I told you he took my admin powers away? Well, down there lies the secret to taking Romeo's powers from him forever. Fred, the third admin, discovered it. Okay. I think I might choose again. There's too many monsters. You have to do it. Help me dig through this tower. What are we going to do? I want to know what's inside. This sounds pretty crazy. See? I told you. These stairs lead to our salvation. We have to go. Now there's a good reason to get a move on. Yes. I didn't want to make another choice. That would have been bad. Oh, I want to know what's going to be down here, but I don't think it's going to let us see. We must be close to the end by now. Looks pretty okay. It's quite dark. But it has the secret to an admin's powers. Oh. Oh, that is the end. That is the end. Oh, man. Okay, so because this game isn't out, I can't actually refresh and see what other choices were here. Because the game's not officially out as of me playing it. So... I'm playing it too early. I am playing it on Monday, but it's too early, which is annoying. But anyway, guys, that is the next episode of Minecraft Story Mode. Oh, wait, wait, wait. There's a preview. What, are we, what is it going to be? Who is that? Oh, of course. Evil Jesse. I can't let anyone run around disguised as me or my friends. The amount of chaos they could cause is, well, it's unthinkable. That's why I summoned you. Yo. Who's this? Track them down. Make sure they're behaving themselves. Who are you? <coughs> Man, oh jeez. <laughs> there we go. It worked this time. He's like a ninja. Run, 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 Jesse. As fast as you can. <laughs> oh. He is so creepy. So evil. Oh, man. That was very cool. I liked it. I liked it a lot. There's still... It's still just like... Season 2 is just so much better than Season 1. It's so much better written. It's just so good. And things are getting really interesting as well. Uh, let me go on the next episode and see what it is. We're only two episodes left. And they're coming out pretty quickly as well, which is crazy. So the next one is Below the Bedrock. Our heroes take a journey to a long forgotten land where nothing is quite what it seems. And danger lurks around every corner. Will Jesse's new alliances and friendships withstand the tests they face? Who knows? And then that is above and beyond. So you might have to go down and then above. Who knows? This is a crazy game. I know you guys love it. I absolutely loved it too. Uh, thank you for hanging out with me today. Uh, as you know, it's been it's been difficult so far, but it's been a lot of fun playing this. And yeah, just thank you for hanging out with me. You guys mean the world to me. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like. That'd be greatly appreciated. And if you want to stick around and find out what happens in Minecraft Story Mode when the when the next one comes out, then please do subscribe and join Team TDM today for daily videos. Apart from that, guys, thank you so much again for hanging out with me. You are the best. You are awesome. Have an amazing day, and I'll see you all next time. Bye. <laughs>